The coastal zone is the shallow water warmed by the sun that extends from the high tide mark on land to the sloping edge of the continental shelf. Plant nutrients that act as fertilizers flow from land and are distributed into the sea by wind and ocean currents. These nutrients blown into the water plus the ample amount of sunlight account for shallow waters having a high net primary productivity. The coastal zone is less than 10% of the world's ocean area, but it contains 90% of all marine species. The Benguela Current goes along the west coastline of southern Africa and meets the Angulas Current coming from the east. Together, these currents bring in an abundance of nutrients along with the ability to support a vast food chain. Seals here thrive off the abundance of fish and squid populations. Large predators who patrol these waters include the stingray and the ragged tooth shark. But the ragged tooth shark is not alone. The great white shark feeds on the seal population. Because of the abundant nutrients, this food chain can survive. Algae blooms in mass numbers because of the fertilized water and ample amount of sunlight the coastal zone receives. Various animals, such as krill, eat this algae, which in turn feeds fish. These fish are eaten by a variety of sea mammals. By midsummer, all the nutrients have been absorbed and the algae dies, collapsing the food chain. Although some areas continue to thrive, like the kelp forests in California. Kelp absorbs nutrients carried in by deep ocean currents and use photosynthesis to grow over two feet per day. Sea urchins, sand dollars, and starfish are lively on the ocean floor. Sunflower starfish are the biggest predators. Off the coast of Australia, the biggest predator is the dugong, but the prey is seagrass. Seagrasses are the only flowering plant that have been able to grow on the ocean floor. Their stems are embedded in the sand. A herd of dugongs can wipe out an entire football field of grass in one day. In the shallows of the coastal zone, bottlenose dolphins have perfected their hunting techniques. They ride the waves close to the shore, hoping to corner their prey. Coral reefs, perhaps the liveliest of all coastal waters, grow with the help of microscopic plants. Algae grows within the tissues of polyps. Polyps feed by catching particles in their tentacles. These are just the building blocks of coral reefs. Animals and plants of all shapes and sizes thrive in these waters.